Welcome to this week's edition of the Fordham Ram Roundup. A-10 Men's Soccer Championship starts this weekend, and we're here with head coach Carlo Aquista. Carlo, team's playing real well here at the end of the season. Two big wins to finish your conference play against George Mason and St. Louis. How is the team feeling going into this weekend? I think in any sport, um, if you get some wins, you start building a confidence about you and a way about you. And I think right now we're building a way of how we want to play and how we want to do things, and we want to be difficult to play against. I know you've mentioned it's all about scoring two plus two plus goals. That's the, that's that magic mark. Those last two games, five total goals in those two games. How is that offense clicking here late in the season? Um, it's clicking pretty well. You know, from where we started and kind of we had a few good games during the course of the year. Uh, we just keep grinding out the same thing we want to keep doing all year, and it, it, it just clicks sometimes. You know, when it clicks. You know, Schwimmer hasn't scored all year, and all of a sudden he has a massive game, and his confidence should be, uh, you know, through the roof right now. You mentioned Tomer. You also had Riccopati score a multi-goal game there late. Those two players coming on late and strong, giving you more dangerous players on the field that have found the score sheet. How, how big is that to have more dangerous players as you enter the championship this weekend? Yeah, we talk about it all the time. You need uh, two to three players on the team can make a difference. And we're hoping going into this weekend, uh, you know, maybe another player steps up and we keep sharing the load and two, three players always stepping up each game will put us in the hunt for, for a W, obviously. Very familiar with this opponent. You just played them last week in St. Louis. Always tough to beat a team twice in one year, especially when it's on their field. What are you expecting on Saturday afternoon? We expect for them to be very, very, very good. Uh, St. Louis has a way about them. They have an unbelievable tradition. Uh, they're going to fight. They're going to be aggressive. They're going to do all the things for them themselves to put themselves in position to win the game. Uh, you know, we're humbled to be playing in this position, and we're fortunate that we're still playing. And at this point, uh, opponent, you kind of doesn't matter. You just want to be playing in a quarterfinal match in the A-10 championship. Well, best of luck on Saturday, Carlo. Thank you so much. We're here with our player interview with Tomer Zlatsover, Tomer a big finish for the team those last two conference games five goals between between the George Mason game and the St. Louis game how is the team feeling as they enter the championship this weekend well so you know we have a group of experienced guys and we all know what it takes to get to postseason so I think we're all prepared the staff you know work every day with us if it's video if it's on the field off the field just prepare us to uh as best as possible and you know so far we show the results and hopefully the upcoming game on Saturday at St. Louis we keep rolling you know. You picked up two goals in that last game at St. Louis to finish the regular season. The fourth different person to score multiple goals in a game this season. How important is it to have that a lot of dangerous people that any given game that hero can come up from anywhere on the field? Well first you know I'm glad that I could help the team you know for us, in the end, of, the end of the day, it doesn't matter who scored, and it, we play for each other. You know, it's it's like family. So, luckily, the last game it was me. As you mentioned, the games before it was Filippo and Hansi, and you know we have good chemistry between all of us. So, we're just happy to help the team, and hopefully, we we score some more in the next game. You know. Always tough to play a team twice in one season, but you play them back-to-back, -back and it's again at their field at St. Louis. What has been the message this week? Because, again, you want to be playing next weekend right here at home. Well, again, I think we're well prepared, and we played them last Saturday, so we kind of know what to expect. We're getting ready for any changes that they might have next next game, but, you know... We focus on ourselves in the end. We know what we're worth. Again, we have a great group of guys that have played in this level, been experienced, you know, the A10 championship before. So I think we are prepared and we'll go for it. Well, best of luck on Saturday. Thank you very much. Thank you.